What's going on YouTube? DJ Brian over here. Uh, what I'm gonna be doing today is uh, an equipment log. Haven't done one in a while. This is actually a retake. I had done one before and there was a lot of feedback for some reason. So I hope this one comes out good. Um, well, we're gonna get started. As a CD player, I have the, um, the CDJ's 800. Uh, great CD player. You can scratch with them. You could, uh, you know, the, for Serato, you know, all the features work, looping, you got this little thingy to make the thingy go to, you know, slow. Got two of them. As a mixer, I have a Vestax, PMC 05 Pro 111 or III, whatever that is. Great mixer, too. Uh, I love it. It's very smooth for scratching and stuff. Got your headphone volume over here. So, you know, it's pretty cool. Uh, as headphones, I got the MDRs. Uh, MDR V700. Um, great headphones, too. Um, you know, they sound, they're pretty loud. And they're closed right now, so, you know. They sound really good. They, they isolate pretty good, but I don't even put them on my head most of the time. So, but yeah, love those, too. I'm using Servato on a PC, HP laptop, 4 gigs of RAM stuff. I got a 1.5 terabyte hard drive over here for my music. Scratch Live. Shore microphone, the PG58. I got a Crown amp. Love this amplifier, bro. It pushes out a lot. Um, Got this little power conditioner. I actually got new speakers. JBL, uh, what is it? MP415. Love the ish out of these speakers, man. They sound amazing. I've actually been, I do gigs with Zuma every single weekend. And when uh, I, he has these, and I fell in love, and I told him, bro, I need to get those. And he actually told me that uh, Sam Ash had them, so I went to Irmas, and he hooked me up with a good price. So I got those. I'm still going to be using these for, uh, you know, big venue schools and stuff. I'll probably put these on the stands real high, or, you know, normal height, and I'll use these to give it the the good bass. Uh, nothing back here, right? No. Got my facade over there. I mean, Kaz made it. Shout out to Kaz on that. Uh, my light stand, my speaker stands over here. I'll show you guys real quick. I love these stands too. Um, you know, for a good price, you get two heavy duty stands. I think I paid 90 bucks for that. These two of these stands in this nice bag. The bag is awesome, you know. The cables over there, gathers tape. You don't know about that, right? <laughs> we got the lights over here. We got the Mystic, that strobe. That's gonna get out because I got a lasers coming on its way right now. I got a, and I actually got a black light too, 48 inch to put on top if I could figure out a way. Got this 70 watt strobe. You know, 70 watts is not a lot, but yo, when like that party I did Saturday, yo, it was, it was perfect for that party. And I'm actually back there this Saturday again. Got the tri-phase. Love this this light, bro. If we could use fog, this light would be even better. But, you know, still real bright. Real good. Well, I was actually lubricating my mixer. <laughs> um, I got the battery back up just in case there's a blackout or anything. You know, my hard drive don't, don't mess up. I think that's it, man. There's only one thing left to do, and that's shout out my brothers. Uh, Musica Union. And, you know, everybody out there on YouTube making videos and all that stuff. Oh, and by the way, uh, YouTube DJ's Live, the new one, you know, we're going to have one in 2011. It's real cool that Gil Boogie want to, you know, want to start organizing it because last year was good. It, last, this year's going to be even better. Hopefully we get a big room and stuff, you know, be hot. But that's basically it, man. Big shout out to Gil Boogie, you know. Everybody, man, alright? Keep it rocking.